What's up, 31 fam? How you doing? Welcome back to Shop 31, hosted by your punk rock dad. It's Friday, Friday, Friday. You know what that means. We are here to show you some stuff that maybe you haven't heard before. Bands you haven't heard, songs you haven't heard, whatever. Uh, maybe you have, but uh, this is a very special one to me. Um, this is Against Me. The song is called Thrash Unreal. Uh, this came out at the height of my drug addiction. This was when I was doing coke almost every day, pills all day every day, drinking three, four, five times a week. I was playing in bands, I was touring, I was partying, I was being a scummy piece of shit, and I was having a blast. And then when reality hit me, it, it wasn't fun. So uh, this is uh, a song that, and it's, the song's about heroin addiction, and um, it's, it's tough to hear, but I love this song with every single fiber of my being. And the singer of this band, uh, in this video, it is a male named Tom Gable. And I met Tom back in the day. Tom is a dead name now, so we don't call Tom Tom anymore. We call her Laura Jane Grace. This is also my first experience ever with transgender people. And I didn't know what to think about it. It affected me in a weird way. I didn't know if I liked it. I didn't know if I was okay with it. And then I, I, I got to understand it. I watched her in interviews. I read interviews with her in magazines. And that's where I got my attitude towards people of that uh, community. Is that I knew somebody from that community and it affected me in a different way. So I'm very fortunate. Um, this is an inclusive community and channel. And I will not tolerate bullies. And I will not tolerate bullcrap. Uh, we are here for each other and I'm here for you. So uh, that being said, it's Friday. Let's party. Thrash Unreal. Let's do it. The song is fucking awesome. If she wants to dance and drink all night, well, there's no one that can stop her. Love this song. Yeah, we do what we do to get by. And we need a I zoned out, bro. I didn't even pause this shit. Oh, this is probably gonna get blocked, but I'm gonna try. Making me cry. Ugh. <sighs> Love this shit though, dude. You gotta have feeling, man. So many people are just walking around every day, just fucking yes sir, no sir, do what I'm told to do. Like, look, man, I'm not saying you gotta go out and be a junkie and do what you're not told to do, but like, dude, fucking do what you want to do. I do what I want to do. It's hard. I don't make a lot of money doing this. I make almost no money doing this. 
but I make it work, man. I'm not working for some fucking dude. Like, I'm just not doing it. Anyways, sorry. I'm, dude, I'm, I'm fucking psyched right now, man. what music's supposed to do to you folks. Sorry, dude. That, that one's an emotional song for me. <sighs> one of my favorite voices in all of music. Um, sorry, it brings back some really dark, dark memories. Uh, and that, you know, makes me happy that I'm here now, you know, because uh, I'm just thinking of a friend that I lost back when this came out. He took one Xanax at the beginning of the party, and then I think about four hours later he took another, but he was drinking beer with it, and he never woke up. He just went to bed, never woke up. But uh, And then I hear this stuff, and I think about my kids. It's, this song is uh, it's powerful, man. Sorry, I, this is... Uh, oh, man. It's one of my favorite songs of all time. Like I'd say top five songs ever for me. And, uh, dude, I talked to them one time, and, I mean, I talked to them multiple times, but, like, I talked to them once about this video when it came out, and I said, uh, dude, what were they, what were they pouring on you guys? And I, I don't remember what it was. I want to say it was just, like, it was, like, wine, something, <laughs> some crazy shit, but they just kept telling me how freezing cold they were making this video, and they just kept dumping it on them and dumping it on them, and I was just like, yo, I, I don't know if I'm willing to do that for a music video. But uh, back when this thing came out, man, we were making videos in like high contrast, black and white, and it was just like a live show, and it was cut and edited. But uh, yeah, my apologies for getting so uh, overwhelmed there for a minute. But I, uh, I, I can't explain to y'all like the stuff that I've had to go through. A lot of y'all are gonna understand. A lot of you aren't. But I'm just so happy that I'm here. Like I, I was getting emotional because I'm so happy that I'm here, and I'm so proud of myself for getting here and working hard and I feel like I've got such a long way to go still but this channel means everything to me and uh, I put a lot of work into it and I appreciate you guys and I appreciate your time and your support and uh, this is why I offer my time to you so if there's something you need I'll let your boy man otherwise take care of yourselves be kind to others and have a good weekend folks I'll see you soon peace